ninth standard social science economics chapter 15 sectors of indian economy fill in the blanks with suitable words main occupation of india is agriculture health and education come under dash sector tertiary sector the total geographical land of karnataka is 1,91,791 square kilometers SBM was established by Dash in 1913, Sir M. Vishweshwaraya. Manufacturing activities belong to secondary sector. The coastline area of Karnataka is 320 km. To expand higher education, Karnataka government has established Karnataka Knowledge Commission. New economic policy was introduced in 1991. Answer the following questions with group discussion. Define primary sector. The primary sector includes agriculture and its allied activities like sericulture, horticulture, animal husbandry, poultry, fishery, floriculture, etc., which provide raw materials to agro based industries. State the different sectors of Indian economy, primary sector, secondary sector, tertiary sector. Explain the importance of industrial sector. It brings higher income to the nation. It provides employment to the people. Standard of living of the people will be increased. It helps to modernize the agriculture as it provides tractors, machineries, fertilizers, etc. reduces the pressure of population on agriculture. Many will migrate to cities and towns. It helps to earn more foreign exchange. Industrial regions also develop as centers of trade, education, transport, banking, etc. Which places of India are called as cradle of banking? Dakshina Kannada Udupi. What is education according to Gandhiji? According to Gandhiji, education brings all round development in personality of the child. State the groups of industries, agro-based industries, forest-based industries, mineral-based industries. List the important irrigation projects of Karnataka, Ghataprabha, Malaprabha, Narayanpura, Almatri Dam, Tungabhadra, Hemavati, Harangi, Krishnaraja Sagara. What is health according to WHO? According to WHO, health refers to the person who is free from physical, mental, social and intellectual disorders.